This is my firstborn daughter's room, and she says, what? I want a new shelf. I want a shelf. Shelves cost money, young lady. So you want it to be out to here. Yep. Next to your Spider-Man poster. Okay. You're not getting anything new. You're going to get a piece of scrap out of my garage. Does that sound okay? Yep. Fantastic. This is a daughter. Every, every dad's, like dream daughter just like yep whatever you say pop that's what i'm talking about let's go find full disclosure we already pulled this thing out what do you think of that though camera lady well we already decided that i liked it yeah yeah so this is white oak out of our forest way yonder i pulled this out what, two years ago used some of it for a table um had some buggies in it, but it's so dry now, we're good. 72 inches. We'll put you right there. How's that? Looks good. Does that strike your fancy? Yep. Yeah, so let me buzz that off and, and we'll, we'll put it in. We got the convertible top down though. Oh no. Oh, well it's not in picture. The wind's going that way. So I, I'm thinking about dust going in there. I think we should be all right. It was free. What are you going to do? Ta-da! You want another shelf? <laughs> All right, let me put this back before I forget to. So you'll have your inside window trim there. So we'll just come up a little bit so you'll see the lip of that piece, but otherwise this will cover it. So I'm thinking right there. Now I'm putting this bracket I'm putting this back uh, bracket behind in hopes that we can kind of kind of hide it. Are you in a position to even see or is my back to walking in? Okay, so uh, da, da, da. are you too close or is that good? I don't know, it's hard to get an angle in here. Hmm. Do you want the stand? We could probably put the stand up. Hmm. I don't know. We'll do this part and then we'll get the stand to show like time lapse the rest of them. Yep, we got in. Just barely. The drywall is double thick here. But that'll hold it for our purposes. We'll get the stand. Okay. Camera lady is off camera lady duty so that she can assist me. Come on over. Put that there, and we put our level. Can you see that? Here, let's just put it there where we can see it better. Oh man, that's about perfect. Now step way back there and tell me if this side needs to go up or down or stay the same. It looks like it's level. Looks like it's level. Sounds good to me. All right, bring me next bracket. Oh, no, I got it right here. And let's mark mark our spot there. And we'll go ahead and mark our spot over here in the corner. Remember, I'm going to be having it sit on this, so. Whoa! That's right, when I put this window in, rather than putting a whole other one in, I, it's uh, not exactly right. So, so 
we got a stud there, but no stud here. That's wonderful. Oh, are you kidding me? They didn't put a stud in the corner? How are you supposed to drywall properly? Well, no wonder the drywall's messed up. There's no daggone thing in the corner. Um, so it's not on that corner. better be on that corner. Do you want me to go get the stud finder? I'm right here. There's one. Ow. I can see a nail here. Okay. Ouch. I'll leave it. Oh, that's for my clock. Well, it took a little skin off. Not not bleeding, but mm. is that thing getting me in the corner? Yeah, it's like it has my the entire poster. Okay. I'm making a mess of your bedspread here. I just washed it. All you have to do is shake it out. It's not dirty. It's just dusty. Mm. Just like your book over here. All right. This one, for whatever reason, bent up a little bit. So I'll just bend that out. Oh. 90. We oh, want a 90 degree angle. That one. Already drilled that one. You getting excited? Mm -hmm. I'm excited. I'm always excited to see a job done, even though this still won't be done because we still have to trim out the rest of your window. Both of my windows. Yeah. That's it, isn't it? That is it. Look at that live edge on that. Oh my goodness. All right, before we screw it down, let's see what it looks like. What do you think? I like it. That's cool, huh? That's with the, the, vi the fake viney things. It almost looks like you're, you know, nature-ish. It, it looks nice. Yeah, I approve. I don't think we need... I might want to put on just because we only have one on stud here. Two on stud there, but it's at a weird angle. So I'm thinking that one's good. This one's meh. If I could find one here. Yep, it's right here. Because you can see the, the nails popping through this old drywall. Right here. I'm going to bat. Oh, yeah, yeah. I was going to say, but I've got this in the way now. Well, yeah, I'll take it out. And then we're going to hope that there's a stud there. I do know where my stud finder is, believe it or not. It's, it's in know. that top drawer. Yeah, I saw it. 
You have multiple, I think. Uh, only one stud finder I'm tracking. No, you have a big, that a big one. That looks lower. Well. Why does that look lower? It looks lower. Does that look lower? But I'm, I'm working off an imperfect board, so we're just going to go with the board. We'll go here in case it's not. We can fix it. Yeah! We've got stud. Studage. All right. much better. A couple extra screws in the wall studs. Oh yeah, that works good. Now we'll go down to these itty bitties. And my bit's probably too big now because it was for larger head screws. Yep, go get me the next size smaller. Please. It's just not a huge priority for me. I know, me. but just. It's one of those like, ah, okay. I know, but I know you don't care because. We've got bigger things. That we have fish, bigger fish to fry, is why I don't care. I, I care, but not as much as the bigger fish. Stick with it if you need to adjust, unless you think it'll show all of them. It shows all of them. So, just working with the contours of the wood. This one's a little bit high. We'll see if we can pull it down. So I'm going to do the ends first. Just one. We'll come back to it. Just one, and if they don't pull all the way tight, it's okay. I'd rather them not pull all the way tight than to put like unneeded pressure on it, so we'll just see. It pulled a little closer, but again, we're just kind of... Gravity will do most of the work for us to keep it there. It in the back's not yet. Let's see. I dare not go anymore. You start feeling a little too much resistance. And here I'm going into the, the transition between the, the good wood and the st stuff that's starting to dry rot. Pulled up a little. That's enough. Stop. I already put your cotton back for you. We were checking to see if it still fit. Just you've got like a quarter was, of an inch. I was kind of like, oh, it fit. We'll have to move it. I 
There you go. Only movement is the flexibility of the brackets. But the brackets are kind of sort of hidden. You know, they're right up on there. They're not underneath like we did on that wall. Um, by the way, that wall, go ahead and show them that wall. There you go. So that one, uh, we used the cheap white brackets you get at Walmart or Lowe's or wherever. Um, I, I thought they were too cheap looking, but they've kind of grown on us. And then the wood is reclaimed deck uh, two by sixes that I ran through the planer a little bit on each side. Yeah. And you seem to like that, right, camera lady? Mm -hmm. And now, why don't you come on over and load this up? The nice thing is the books will block the brackets a little bit, you know, if you, if you put them there to, to hide them. All your ducks, what? Put one in the lean to. Yeah, there you go. Ducks. Okay. Well, how's that look? Wouldn't be my aesthetic choices, but you know, it's my kid. She can do what she wants. Those LEDs are not flashing like it might look like. Uh, something about the frequency that they do their things. Anyway, have a good one.